Hello, Dan and Phil Games jockeys. And we don't mean disc. Waka waka, no. No. Keeping the pastel vibe going. You can see I've reverted back to my old ways. You've got care. a little bit yeah, of yeah. pastel purple there. A tiny little bit. Ray or nipple? Hope. No, no okay. that's quite. I, I really have a problem if you were just sat there going nipple, 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 <laughs> nipple, 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 nipple. Woo. So, Dan, you have chosen the game today. What's happening? Yes, well, there are lots of games on the App Store that are made in Japan yeah. that you can download around the world. My favourite kind. And as we all know, Japan is weird AF with their strange sense of humour and the anime and the strange moral sex stuff that <laughs> we can't relate to. I'd say it's more endearing and cool. So today we are playing a dating simulator of yes. sorts. Okay. No, no yandere, this isn't scary, this oh. is just wholesome. All right. However, it's between a woman and a horse. Today <laughs> we are playing Uma Pri, also known as... My horse prince. We're a woman dating a horse. We are playing a horse dating simulator. Is this is legal? Like, this is something that um, I had recommended to me around Christmas. Yeah. And may have played privately. So this is your favourite game that you play every night in a bed? A bit. But I thought today we could go through the adventure together. So the first step is we need to enter the name. Now the protagonist is called Umako. So is this the name of the horse? No, of the, of the uh, main character you play the girl. Oh. Because so you are dating the horse. It's right. my horse prince. Oh, okay. Right. So the girl can be called... We can't call her Susan again. Susan, no, but we could call her Susan Kuhn. Is that offensive? Who knows? Susan Kuhn. Oh, I like that magical sprinkle of noise. There's a lot of magical segues in this. <laughs> so, here we are. Oh, what a pleasant meadow. Let's see what happens. A normal ranch in a normal city. I came all the way to the beautiful countryside for a single purpose. Is this the voice of the girl? Because I think you need a girl voice here. I used to work at a major company slaving away to build a career, but one day I lost sight of what I was doing. <laughs> I wasn't dissatisfied with the job itself, but I hadn't the chance to meet any good-looking guys. Yeah. I think we can all relate to that. I poured so much of myself into my work that my only interaction with men was at the office. Is that so bad? Professional, I don't know, this is gonna hurt my voice. <laughs> An office full of middle-aged salary men nobody would call attractive. And so, the young girl within me longed for some excitement. It was then I realised my prince would never come being stuck in that stuffy old place. So I decided to take a vacation to this ranch. Why a ranch, you ask? Well, that's because... Oh, are you oh, ready? I'm ready. Here we go. My horse prince. So she's gonna fall in love with an animal. What, Phil? You're gonna see. You're gonna see. <laughs> Episode one. The first gallop. Now... What is this game, Dan? <laughs> this is Susan Coon right here. What a pleasant, relatable girl. Pastel blouse. I'm sure. She's feeling the same Yeah, you know, just the kind of everyday character we can all put ourselves in the perspective of. If she's going to fall in love with a horse, I'm not thinking she's a respectable girl. Well, you need to see for yourself okay. first, okay? They say princes ride horses, so I thought there'd be some at a ranch. But there's just a big blue sky and some fresh air. Now, I think you can uh, voice this guy. <laughs> oh, hey, haven't seen you around here before. Oh, the first person I've seen here. Hi, does this ranch have horses? <laughs> I love it. it just looks like a drawing <laughs> compared to her. You betcha, we train racehorses here. Do any hot guys come? Because, you know, if, you, if you, the Forward. office isn't putting it out there, then maybe there's some hot jockeys. Just came to a ranch to look for hot guys. <laughs> yeah, she guys. literally just went, it's, hi, it's nice to meet you. Any hot guys around here? <laughs> I mean, commendable, sure, Susan. Maybe he's into it. Susan is thirsty. Hot guys? We get jockeys. <laughs> oh, okay. Doesn't look like my prince is here. Are you here to see some horses? Oh, uh, yes. Sure, I mean, why not like it? Couldn't care less. She hates horses. Not here for the horses, well, just here for the jock. Where's this gonna go, then? Susan Coon has priorities. Well, there's one over there. Go have a closer look. All right, seeing as I'm here. That's him there. Okay. Sparkle. <laughs> oh, my God. What? That. What is that? Is the horse. <laughs> why has it got a boy's face? Oh, my God, he's really hot. I'm so confused. No, he's a monster. <laughs> nice features, right? His name's Yuma. 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 Totally. Um, he has a human head. A good looking one at that. What's that? <laughs> Missy, don't tell me. You're seeing the horse as a man. Uh-oh. Yeah, he's really subjectively hot. <laughs> Let me guess. Your year of the horse. Yeah, I am. I heard that weird girls born in the year of the oh horse. Oh my god, it's fruits basket. Oh, There's a zodiac right. magic, but oh, but forgot. I thought it like it was a horse with a prince's head. Yes. This is making her seem like her zodiac goggles. 
and it's just a horse. It's just a horse, and that she's seeing it that, as something else. That means that it is just a horse. Is she going to start making out of the horse? Okay, this just got, like, way more re-effed up in my head. Anyway, <laughs> back in the immersive story. Sometimes see horses as attractive men. There are several theories to explain several this. Several theories, yeah. That's not possible, right? Is this some kind of newfangled trick? People with that ability are really something special. Praise, praise. Don't worship me. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so Phil, now yeah. you have to do your best guy that's like, what's going on? So you have to do okay. a hair flip. What's going on? Dreamy voice, <laughs> I got that. <laughs> ah, he talks! I haven't seen you around here before. A bit more cuter, because he's like, yeah. he's gentle. Okay. I haven't seen you around before. What brings you here? Just uh, looking for hot guys. Oops, <laughs> shouldn't have said that. Yeah. By the way, uh, what exactly are you? I'm just a normal racing horse. There's nothing normal about you! <laughs> this is quite funny, though. See, this is what I wanted you to see. This game isn't just, like, a weird game. It's yeah. actually, like, super ironic it has and a sense funny. Of so it knows that this is weird, and that's the whole point. Okay, so I'm getting with it's it. It's not laughing at it, it's really laughing I'm, with it. I'm into it. Way to pick on me. Oh, no. Am I that strange? You're more scary than strange. This is a terrifying experience! Wow, that's harsh. But I don't hate you for it. Huh? Does this guy like me? It's a horse, Susan! No! I can't get the wrong idea! He's a horse! A horse! He neighs and whinnies! Woo! Good one, Phil. Missy, why don't you give him some food? Huh? Food? There's some carrots over there, just give him those! <laughs> oh! Okay. I've got to stop doing what I'm told. So is this the... <laughs> Here we are. Is this the gameplay? Welcome to the gameplay. Mission start. Carrots will appear with time. Tap on the carrot to feed Yuma. Be careful, he'll lose energy if you feed him too many. You get a different amount of points depending on his energy level. You can restore his energy by talking to him. Ooh. Make sure you talk to Yuma by clicking on the talk button at the bottom of the... Okay, okay have fun. fun. Here you are, Phil. Welcome to the gameplay. Yay. Basically, there's a bar at the top. When you fill the bar, you get to the next story chapter, <laughs> and the walking. gameplay is the thrilling action <laughs> of doing the activity, which okay. in this case is tapping carrots to feed him. I mean, he's quite a dreamy anime character. You I, can I, see I'm the confusion. The confusion. The, the, it's really, it's a complex drama about moral grey zones. And he's quite a meaty horse as well. Just saying. <laughs> okay, <laughs> well, I, I expected a few episodes before we started empathising with Susan Kuhn. Yeah, shall I press some carrots? Yeah, feed him. Okay, here we go. <laughs> Woof! There he goes, munching those cars. Wow. You have to do the voice, Phil. Okay. Nom 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 nom. He can't stop. Just eat the carrots. Now, as you'll see, the more carrots you eat, the less the energy goes. Oh, you'll okay. You'll fail the mission if he dies. Oh. I kind of want some now. Come on. He probably likes them because they're real carrots today. Um, <laughs> what, what does he fake? usually feed him? That's what is so a fake weird. carrot? Today? So, what you do to speed up his energy is you talk to him. Oh, so okay. Tap that. Here we go. Hey, horsey. Time for some dating sim. <laughs> Ooh. What do you think of carrots? Now, you get three options, oh, Phil. Oh my god. One of them is the horse prince's preferred answer. Should I do my preferred answer? You can either piss him off and make him sad, make yeah. him like okay happy, or make him super happy. I want to make him super happy. Yeah, that, that's the whole point of this. So it, you could say... You can choose to be honest with yourself, or yeah. say what you think the horse prince wants you to be. I want to say I like their orange colour, because I think they are an interesting coloured vegetable. Go then, see how he reacts. You get it, I think you and I might just become friends. Excellent! Excellent! Phil, well done! Yes! That was the plus 30 answer, there he you go. He loves me! Right now, if you get him to like above 80, he gets like double points. I so love you can how try much you know about this. Talk. Oh god, I do, don't I? He He's still going? He's a grown horse lady, what do yeah. you expect? Eat right. those carrots. Talk to him again, try to get him into that winning zone. Okay. Do you like ranches? Ooh, Oof. I do, not really, or yeah, just not this place. I mean, he lives on a ranch, so surely I do. Let's see. I do. They're nice, right? You have good taste. Excellent, <laughs> Phil! I what could, can I say? You have a natural affinity with anthropomorphic horses. I could date a human horse. Right, one more second. time. Let's let's go for ninety five percent. Okay, it's oh, gonna be come incredible. On, come okay. on. What's the weather gonna be like tomorrow? Ooh, sunny. Don't of mess this up. I think it's gonna rain. Cloudy, I guess. Now think, if you're a horse prince and you want him to fall in love with you, Ooh. do you want to be really optimistic all the time? Do you want to be a bit mysterious? Do you want to play hard to get? I think. What, what's the vibe you want to send him? Maybe he'll get sunburned, so maybe I'll be like, cloudy, I guess. I feel like the comma's like, cloudy, I guess. I guess. But then it's like, sunny, of course, or 
I think it's going to rain. What? What is it? I think it's going to rain. Because then rain. his crops will get watered and he'll have more carrots to eat. Bold choice. Oh! I think you'd look cute, Cod, in the rain. Ex <laughs> oh my god, Phil! What the it. hell? I did it! You're amazing! I am the ultimate horse data. He's steaming. What that, does that mean? That means that he's just like, he's super energetic. Oh my god, ready to it, chow down on some carrots. What's he want to do? Just eat. Just eat. <laughs> why, why is he so steamy? Because of the activity, which is eating carrots, Phil. I already this was is like, like The Sims. He's not having a steamy shower. I already was like dill. No. So can I just Yeah, yeah, tap, more? tap the shit out of those carrots. Oh my god, he ate them all in Woof. one mouthful. And there we go. <laughs> Your bond has grown stronger. There we go. So now we're gonna kiss. Um, maybe, I don't know, where's the story going? He sure did eat a whole lot today. <laughs> I don't know what this voice is. I think it's a good voice. <laughs> he eats like a horse, probably because he is a horse. <laughs> hmm, I could give food to a good looking guy. Susan, Susan, calm trash down. trash bag, keep it together. That'll be the poor thing's last meal. <laughs> Wait, what? His owner just quit, you see. Oh my God, the jockey bailed. What? And I can't look after him. Oh, that's terrible. Poor thing. I feel sorry for him now. If only there was someone who could look after him. I wonder where this is going. Susan, don't take him into your house. <laughs> Isn't owning a horse expensive? You betcha. Too expensive for me. Of course you'd need money. How much exactly? Oh. Thud, 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 he's thud, thud. Wow. Oh, <laughs> calm down. Wow. <laughs> what is he doing? He's, he's zazzed from the carrots. Yeah. I think that's what it is. Hey, slow down there, buddy. <laughs> Thud! This headbutter. They made contact. Wow. <laughs> what am I looking at? <laughs> this feels so wrong. Oh my god, he smashed the wall. <laughs> Is this romantic or scary? Hey. <laughs> <laughs> huh? What's happening? Is this the thing you see in movies? So, Boom. will you be my owner? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, I can't You've handle got to this. Say yes. Um, okay. Oh my god. What? I didn't even hesitate. <laughs> Great. Looking forward to working with you. I feel a bit creepy now. <laughs> Great. Looking forward to working with you, owner. Oh. Yeah. First of all, can you lower that hoof and calm down a little? <laughs> I'd be like terrified. Oh. I would have died if he was an inch closer. It's dangerous being in love with a horse. Yes. So wait, I'm his owner now? Is this a threat? There's a cooling off period, right? Like you own the horse forever. <laughs> but I can feel my heart racing. Could this be? How does this game end? Is what, what could I it be? Oh. oh. Episode, Next episode two. See the little farmer guy? Yeah. The tuxedo there. Important character. Having become a horse owner in the blink of an eye, Susan Kung came to her senses and visited the farm again to quit. I want to go back to the city. Yeah, this is she weird. Wants to get out of there. Nope. But she couldn't find the right words looking at that pretty face. <laughs> and so Yuma asked Susan Kun to start training. Why is he pixelated? Though? I guess What's it's the spoiler of the next episode. Uh, okay. Here we go. But Susan Kun is in for a shock. Dun dun dun. Next episode. Treadmill training. Here we go. I'm ready for this. All right. A girl in love with a human-faced horse. What, why is it saying That's that? That's the name of the game. Oh. My horse pants. They've nailed the dreamy aesthetic of yeah. this. I mean, how how in deep are you at this point? I'm in the so. Video? I want to know. Are you like happens. this is weird? No help. Or are you like this is funny? I appreciate yeah. the funny writing. Or are you just like you, Macoon? <laughs> Hit me with your hooves! Stop! Stop! stop. Right, right. This after this episode is when I stopped playing yeah. and thought we need to do this on the gaming channel. If you want to know what happens next, we could do another one. Yeah, I mean, I'm up to. I thought this would be quite funny just to show people that this insane weird game exists. Yeah. But if you want us to end this, you know, go all the way, all the way to the end. I've said all the way <laughs> as well with this story. Let us know. Thumb it up if you want us to. Click subscribe to our channel if you want to see more horsey the adventures. The future of this horse romance. Our if last it didn't video you too much. Yeah, our last video is over there, our channels are here, and remember, don't fall in love with horses. Because apart from the zodiac magic, you are just making out with an animal, and that's like illegal and stuff, so yeah. I'm kink shaming you right there. Goodbye! <laughs>